Yeah, hello everyone. This is Ankit Shivare, and uh, today we are going to discuss on common source amplifier, right? <coughs> so specifications you can see from the sheet. So we have specifications. Uh, VDD is five volt, mu n is six fifty centimeter square volt per volt per second. Tux is two hundred and fifty power minus eight centimeter. Gain we need is sixteen, and id is ten minus two. So I can write down these things. So comment is uh, <coughs> we have been given with supply of five volts. Uh, I T is ten point two microampere. Then uh, we have uh, T O X of two hundred, two hundred E minus eight, E minus eight centimeters. Then uh, what we need is gain is of sixteen. The gain that we need is sixteen, and uh, output common mode level we want is at two point five volts. Okay, means that uh, output uh, that will be at 2.5 volts. That is the DC condition. The threshold voltage of uh, NMOS is 0.8 volts, and uh, W by L ratio uh, that has to be 5 by 2. Okay, 5 by 2. So this is actually we want. We just put it up here, so it makes some sense, right? So this is the actually requirement that we have, right? We can move it in the top actually. So look better. Yeah, here it looks better, right? Space bar fit. Okay. Now, <coughs> for these uh, ca calculations, when we calculated, so we started with the calculations uh, uh, by this current fixed. So we tried to calculate the VGS. So that VGS uh, we can directly take out from the resistor divider circuit, and we take this resistance to a one ohm. So this we was calculated to be three point six seven ohms. So this VGS that we need was point. Uh, 1.07 volts. Okay, as per the calculations that we made, means hand written calculations, right? Okay, and uh, the uh, we wanted uh, what is the VDS we wanted, right? So RD calculation uh, we did from the gain. So uh, the gain was 16. So gain is nothing but GM times RD. So we know GM of this transistor for a particular uh, ID. That is flowing. So ID is 10.2 microamperes. So since VGS is fixed, so ID will be fixed because it is a common source amplifier, right? So ID is fixed. So uh, we know uh, what is the gain that we will get, 16. Okay. So GM times RD. So as per that, we calculated RD. That is 0.25 megaohms. So for uh, seeing this uh, simulation results in LT spice, what we need to go is, so this schematics you can draw, right? This schematics not a problem, right? So Uh, I need to one more label is uh, I need to label so we need a input port so we can say this is the V in right right now it makes some sense now I can just uh, run the simulation and see the DC operating point but uh, I need to set DC operating point so this is dot op okay so I am not able to find the model of this right. So uh, how I have uh, put up this MOSFET is uh, from this. Uh, you go to components, components, and I am taking this uh, NMOS four. Okay, NMOS four. You can see this is the symbol. So I have drawn this here, right? So uh, I need a model for this NMOS. So I can I have to include some libraries, right? So you can just include mm, dot include. So actually, in my folder, these files are there. So BSIM four underscore models. So BSIM. So BSIM four underscore models. Yeah. So just I include this one. So it is able to find that library. So actually this BSIM four models. I can just uh, try to open it up and show it to you how it looks. So yeah, this is the BSIM four models. So this is the log channel model. Okay, which are these values? And uh, this is the PMOS model. This is the short channel models for NMOS as well as short channel model for PMOS. So minimum channel length is 100 nanometer, and in uh, one micrometer for uh, long channel, and uh, for short channel is 50 nanometer minimum length. Okay. So I hope it makes some sense. So I have included that model, and now I am including the DC operating point. So I just can make a run. Okay. So it is saying that uh, uh, model will cancel to quit now. Okay. So it is not able to find it saying.
dot include PCM4 underscore models. PCM4. Okay, I should have uh, mentioned here one more thing. Is this is dot text txt. Okay, it doesn't make sense. So actually, uh, how to not list this file? This is the spice inclusive directory. Okay, it does make some sense. Yeah, now it makes some sense. Okay, so this is a spice uh, inclusive directory. So include BCM4 model select text, and now I can see the values like VD is 5 volts, V out that is 2.85 volts, V in is 1.07 volts, that is as per calculations, right? And ID is this much. Similarly, uh, currents you can calculate. So this is a DC operating point I've set up. Now I need to uh, see the gain. Gain that I about is 16, right? So the gain that you need is 16. So that is 24 dB approximate. So I need a. I need to include for that case voltage sources. So I will go to voltage. Okay, place it here. Okay. Now I can just. Uh, right click go to advanced i want uh, ac amplitude of 1 okay and uh, i want a ac picture right so i want sign so ac amplitude is 1 so that's it i don't care about it there so i need a capacitor because uh, i want a ac voltage source to pass through it so i just put c control r just place it here okay and wired up so function f3 is the trick for wiring just drag it up yeah now I need a capacitor here as well so just to move this one plus to C and wire yeah now it makes some sense right so uh, what what I want is a AC picture again. So I need a capacitor. I can just say it is to be 10 microfarad. This also I can just say it is 10 microfarad. Okay. The sine amplitude is one, and now I can just uh, have to uh, spice analysis. Go to AC analysis. Decade number of points I want in 100. Start frequency one from one hertz, and I'm going till one gigahertz. Okay. So this is one more directive I put up, and uh, I can just make a run. So this window will open, and now I want to see the gain, right? So this is one. So yeah, you can see. Uh, uh, so I should change this colors actually, right? So tools, color preference, and. Uh, trace V one these traces I want it to be black or I want it to be red yeah red looks good right yeah so this is, is my magnitude plot this is my face plot looks good right this figure so gain is of 24 dB so uh, this is the AC plot now I also I want to see the transient simulation okay so transient simulation I can just go to spice analysis transient I want it from 10 nano till I want is 10 milli. Press OK. Okay. For transient, <coughs> I need to put up sign value. Offset is 0. Amplitude, I am saying it to be uh, the gain is 30, right? So 30 millivolt. So you can say 30. So yeah, 10 millivolt will be good, right? Yeah, 10 millivolt should be good. Frequency, suppose I am saying it is. Mm -hmm. 100 kilohertz and doesn't matter anything else right okay now I can make a run yeah so what I want is this amplitude so just I can elaborate this one 
make a plot pane okay and uh, i can just drag it here right zoom it out so you can just zoom it out to very low value yeah so you can see here so the input is uh, going from uh, this is my input right v and 002 yeah this is my input so this is uh, 10 millivolt is the input and the output is 120 millivolts right and it is not distorted so it looks good right yeah so i am having a 180 degree phase shift that is a common source you have 180 degree phase shift you can see the start is going positive and here is start is going negative right yeah so now i want to uh, one more thing is suppose i want to uh, increase the gain now the gain that you are getting here is is uh, 16 right you can see that uh, uh, it's almost uh, 12 times this gain 10 millivolt and it is going to 120 right 12 times gain is something yeah so i want the gain to double up so what i can do is uh, for gain to be double i can make uh, this rd to be four times okay so just i open new schematic yeah or i have already done that actually so just open that schematic yeah and uh, same things i have done here okay now i make this because gain i want is double so i can just make it 1 milli the frequency i can make is 100 kilohertz a simple to this one i want again the tra transient plots for all these things so i have baked this rd rd as 1 mega ohms so vgs i have to change so i have make this r3 and r4 for that 4.36 and 1 mega ohms okay and uh, uh, i want a v out for that case so dot ac decade and uh, first let us see the ac plot right so just make a run okay so i should close this one which are not required so this i don't need save changes yes and uh, what i need is run for this one okay and uh, what i want is the gain yeah so gain has increased right it is now 30 db so that is double almost yeah 32 times gain so now i should see the transient plot for this yeah so edit spice analysis then transient dot transient and i want 10 nano and i want to go till 10 milli and i just place it here okay and uh, we can also see that uh, operating point also yeah so now my input is 1 milli volt and so you can see the output is going 30 milli volt so i can just uh, zoom it out all for you so i want also this things v in so and i will see output here v out okay so v out so what i can do is for this case add plot pane and uh, just input my self here and uh, just uh, make it little bigger and i will zoom it out yeah so you can see the input is 1 millivolt and my output is going from till 30 millivolt yeah and uh, output is phase shift right so we can just zoom it out a bit and you can see here so this is my output v out and this is my input so it look gain is doubled right it makes some sense so this is the common source amplifier configuration uh, i have uh, uploaded uh, two sheets uh, for the calculation purpose you can see and uh, this is the dc operating point 3.14 that is here we wanted 2.5 it's okay 3.1 and uh, uh so you understand now that the uh, gain is doubled uh, i have uh, modified this rd and uh, from that we can uh, change the gain value okay i have made this rd four times so current is now just half okay so i should show you the current as well so so just i can remove this uh, transient and uh, mm, make a, a current value you want right dc operating point dot op and just make a run again so you can see the current uh, is now i r2 you can see 1.8 micro ampere yeah okay so it makes some sense right so we wanted it is uh, current uh, so from the device also we can so okay if suppose we wanted to uh, current from device how will we do that uh, just go to spice directive and just say dot save and what you want to save is m2 
ठीक है एंड जस्ट मे करन या सो यू कैन सी आई डी फ्रॉम एम टू इट इज फ्लोइंग नाउ इट इज वन पॉइंट एट नाइन माइक्रो एम्पियर्स दिस इज द करंट इट इज फ्लोइंग राइट सो दिस सिंटेक्स मेक सम सेंस राइट सो दिस इज ऑल फॉर दिस कॉमन सोर्स एम्पलीफायर वी कैन हैव फर्दर डिस्कशन ऑफ अ कॉमन ट्रेन कॉमन क्रिएट एम्पलीफायर इन द नेक्स्ट ट्यूटोरियल थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग थैंक्स फॉर योर